poverty, a condition that exists to varying degrees in virtually every jurisdiction and society on Earth. And yet, there are ways to improve conditions for even the poorest of the poor, as detailed in the Fraser Institute's annual Economic Freedom of the World Report. High levels of personal choice, easy access to markets, low taxation, limited government regulation, and rule of law. In short, economic freedom. Each year, the Economic Freedom of the World Report shows that countries with high levels of economic freedom experience less poverty. Let's look at the numbers, based on data from 157 countries and territories worldwide. When it comes to income, people in countries with the most economic freedom earn substantially more money than people in the least economically free countries. And in all of these countries, the amount of income earned by the poorest 10% of the population is much higher in countries with greater levels of economic freedom. Where there's more economic freedom, it's easier to accumulate savings and start or expand a business or find a job. This helps increase income levels, including among the poorest 10%. Another thing, where economic freedom increases, literacy rates rise. In the most free countries, literacy rates eclipse 93%, yet drop below 65% in the least free countries. And the life expectancy in countries with the most economic freedom is about 17 years longer than in countries with the least. Higher incomes, better education, longer, healthier lives. The fruits of economic freedom. To read this year's Economic Freedom of the World Report and to learn more about economic freedom, visit www.freetheworld.com.